Oh, Spider-Man, yes, yes. They've made so many Spider-Man movies, like, when is it enough? Where are they? Justice League? Yo, we finally get a cyborg! Which of these two movies are you more excited to see? Today we're gonna show you two movie trailers that both released this week. Okay, I love movies. Ooh, all right, I'm a movie buff. I like movies, I'm excited for this. I have an idea of what these might be. Are they <clears throat> superhero trailers? <gasps> oh, my heart. Oh, it's Spider-Man. Oh, Spider-Man, yes, yes. Spider-Man. Yep, I was right. It's Spider-Man Homecoming. What's up, guys? <laughs> I follow the kid on Instagram because he's so cute and I think he's the perfect Spider-Man. So to become an Avenger, are there like trials or? Oh, is that Tony Stark in this? Is he coming in the Avengers? Finally! Yeah. Oh my God. Stay close to the ground. You're the Spider-Man. <laughs> that would be my reaction too. Can you summon an army of spiders? No, Ned, no. Can I try the suit on? Badass. I think it's kind of cool how juvenile he is. The rich and the powerful, like Stark, they don't care about us. Like, this is like the third time we changed to Spider Man reboot in my lifetime. They've made so many Spider Man movies. Like, when is it enough? The world's changing, boys. Time we change to. That's the dopest vulture I've ever seen. Finally introducing a villain we haven't seen in the previous ones. Forget the flying monster guy. There are people who handle this sort of thing. The illegal weapons barrier was at 2.30. You missed it. Oh, this looks so good. God, I'm really excited for this. The, the boat's falling apart. What is this, fucking Superman again? What? Yes. Go, Iron Man. What if somebody had died? I'm very excited. I'm just trying to be like you. I wanted you to be better. I'm gonna need the suit back. But oh I'm my God. I'm nothing without this suit. If you're nothing without this suit, then you shouldn't have it. Oh, that's deep. You need to stop carrying the weight of the world on your shoulders. I'm getting no, chills, Jesus. Understand. I'll do anything to protect my family. Whoa. I know you know what I'm talking this about. This looks so cool. Boy, I'm hyped. Because I will kill you and everybody you love. Who could that be? Gwen? Maybe Mary Jane? The guy is still out there. I just got to do this on my own. Ah. That <laughs> looks so scary. Yes. Yes. Just. I want to see this. I just love how Marvel does their movies. Like, they never disappoint. Just don't do anything stupid. I got this. All right? Yeah. I'm watching that opening night. I can literally watch this all day and be just content, you know? Like, it's Spider-Man. They always cast, like, older people to play Spider-Man, but it's supposed to be, like, this young, nerdy kid, and I think they got this so right. We have to be ready. You, we. I have no idea what this is. There's an attack coming from far away. Not coming, Bruce. What? Not coming, Bruce. Oh, it's Batman. It's already here. Oh, what the? The others. Where are they? Justice League? Is this a Justice Where are they? League? Wonder Woman, Batman. <gasps> Yo! Arthur Curry, the Aquaman. He looks like he's gonna be so cool, even though like the running joke is Aquaman sucks. Dude, he is the most badass Aquaman. They made the like corniest superhero into the most badass dude. Organic and biomechatronic body parts. He's a cyborg. Yo, we finally get a cyborg! And cyborg, man. He's a cyborg. <sighs> DC's making a comeback. Barry Allen. Whoever you're looking for, it's not me. Ezra Miller Flash, okay. 
You're the Batman. Ben Affleck is Batman? But has he always been Batman? He said the age of heroes would never come again. It has to. I'm getting, I'm getting excited chills. Wait, isn't Superman a part of the Justice League? It feels kind of incomplete with Superman not there. Wonder Woman's badass. The girls were Harley Queen this past Halloween. Now everyone's gonna be Wonder Woman. What are your superpowers again? I'm rich. It's very true. At least they were honest about it this time. I'm rich. I'm rich. <laughs> Wouldn't we all love to have that superpower? My turn. I love their choice in music for the trailer. I love when they put rock music to this stuff. It's so badass. Okay, this looks cool. I really like DC, but like, Christian Bale's not like Batman anymore. That's f awesome! It's good to see you playing well with others again. Just like a bat. I dig it. Maybe temporary. <laughs> oh, so good. Okay, guys. I'm so excited. Batman's the only saving grace for the DC universe when it comes to movies, if we're going to be honest, because all the other ones are kind of like, eh. It looks like a decent superhero movie. It's not like I'm like, I gotta go see it at midnight, but maybe like a red box. It doesn't look like it's going to flop as much as Superman versus Batman. I'm so hyped for both movies. You don't even know. F Yes. <laughs> I'm so psyched for that. So you just watched the trailers for Spider-Man Homecoming and Justice League. Ugh, I was so freaking excited. So first of all, what do you think of Spider-Man? I think it's cool. They definitely should have stuck with like Andrew Garfield just because it's really annoying having three Spider-Mans in the same decade. This is the first like Spider-Man franchise like reboot that I'm excited to see. It's probably gonna be one of the best ones to come out just because I think the actor is probably one of the best Spider-Man that they've they've casted. Spider-Man is dope. He's my favorite Marvel superhero. I'm super excited to see like this new rendition. We finally get a real 15 year old Peter Parker, which is how the comic book started as. A lot of superhero movies are action packed, which I'm, I guess that's what most people like, but I also like, you know, moments where the superheroes are kind of real and like actual normal people. And I feel like Spider-Man definitely has a lot of that. And what about Justice League? So-so. Mm. Mm, Most DC movies besides the Batman ones are kind of a letdown. It was just your typical superhero movie. I'm more of a Marvel girl, you know? But DC, like maybe they win me with this one. That movie looks so good. The fact that all of them are together, like my favorite one. I, I never thought I'd say Aquaman is my favorite superhero, but he looks so badass. Oh, the heroes look so badass. Like, I would have never imagined them to look that cool. That's really cool to see, you know, what we used to see on cartoons, Justice League United and all that, finally get made into like a real, a real like live um, thing. So both of these movies are part of comic book cinematic universes, Spider-Man being a part of Marvel and Justice League being a part of DC. What are your thoughts on each of these franchises? Personally, I think that Marvel is a little bit more sugar-coated. Um, it's a little bit more on the easy side, whereas DC, they go all out with the action, the you know, the soundtracks, everything like that. It's very dark for DC. I like DC because it's like a real dark twist on on superheroes. I really like the darker superhero stories, the ones that like come from psychological issues. DC movies have been a little redundant. Like it's. To me, it's just nothing that we've never really seen before. DC hasn't been doing too well in the like movie stuff, so I've been liking the Marvel stuff better, and DC has been letting me down. But I think that this could bring DC back. And finally, which of these two movies are you more excited to see? Spider-Man. My spidey senses are telling me that I like Homecoming a little bit better. As much as I love DC, I just, I really want to see how Spider-Man turns out. I'm more excited to see Spider-Man Homecoming. I'm sorry, Spider-Man. I'm gonna have to give it up for Justice League. It's just... There's so many badasses together. I'm more excited for Justice League because it's DC. I'm more of a DC fan than a Marvel fan. Probably Justice League. Batman and Wonder Woman and freaking Aquaman, who I'm apparently obsessed with, like, it, it's just so badass. I'm more excited to see Spider-Man. Robert Downey Jr.'s in it, and I love Iron Man. 
So I think those two together are gonna be a really good combination. Definitely Spider-Man Homecoming. I'm Team Marvel. I just think they're cooler. Sorry, DC. Thanks for watching this super episode of College Kids React. Subscribe, we have new React episodes four times a week. We'll see you in the next video, I gotta fly. <sighs> I can't fly. Hey guys, it's Ethan here from FBE. Thank you so much for watching this episode of College Kids React. And we have plenty more episodes for you to watch, so go ahead and click on some of them. They're all down below, click away.